Hey yo, welcome back everybody to the fishing playthrough. Ooh, got a grasshopper leg. Excuse any like pauses and stutters in game and during the recording. I don't know what's wrong with my terraria today. I had trouble launching it. Just like just in general, just launching the game up. Uh, so I restarted my computer and then launched up fine, but it's still doing like stutters. And then when I was loading into the world, this is actually pretty useful, but I don't know if it's more useful to replace it with something else. I don't know. Uh oh, kill it. Kill it. All right. Thanks for the garbage. I think we got to get rid of this until we can upgrade it because I feel like it's ass. Oh my God. We're not upgrading that anytime soon. It seems like I don't like it. Plain and simple. I don't like it. But yeah, I have a goal for us today. And that goal is to kill a bunch of flinxes and be like, gamers, why are you killing flinxes? What do they do to you? They smell. Not only that, I need their like fur for something very specific before we like fully hop in to find our first boss. We're going to need what they what they drop. Hopefully you guys can hear me. This music seems really fucking loud. Let's see here. Let me look at some battle rod stuff. OK, so we probably can make a silver and platinum one. There's a jungle one that isn't hard to make at all. Hellstone, golden edge. I love edging. <laughs> Don't quote me on that. Copper cactus. So what do we do right now? We do 22. Okay. I think we should probably just make a tungsten or silver one if possible. Because we want to slowly be upgrading. Just so we're just getting stronger here and there. Does this stack into any other chests? No, it does not. Does that mean, does that mean I'm like having... Oh, we got a bunch of silver right here. Okay, what do we need for a silver battle rod? Let's just look at a tungsten one. Pretty much the same thing. Tungsten one's, I'm assuming, stronger than a silver one. Yeah, so we'll probably just make tungsten. So we just need five cobweb. Easy. Nice and easy recipe. Just how I like it. We only need five, right? It was five tungsten? No, it was ten. Okay. No problem, no problem. That's, that's easy work. I know you guys are probably getting tired of this music. I am too, man. It's too eerie for me. I like it. I fuck with it. But it's too eerie. That's just spooking me a little bit. Give me a little spook. So we need a fishing rod. This one only has 10 fishing power. We need a fishing rod that's primarily fishing power. Know what I'm saying? And I think Battle Rod actually has some that are primarily fishing power, but I have not gotten any of them yet. But yeah, I expect this episode to try and get this little gold done. Uh, let me actually store. That's like my fishing chest. I don't really want to put anything in there. Dude, what can I put? All right, bring that with us uh throw that away i guess all right good to go kill him yep yeah, we're gonna do we're gonna grab this fishing stuff or not fishing stuff well yeah it is fishing stuff from these flinxes i have no idea how i'm supposed to get out of here oh my god we gotta use rope that was like a crisis right there go higher okay that's fine no 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 let him jump yeah, we're gonna do some fishing today too like a lot of it because i'm trying to get a bunch of gear right now well a bunch of maybe not gear when it comes to like armor and accessories i need some weapons this is all i got for weapons <laughs> so uh we'll see what we can get done snow biome's to the left right that guy's still just down there bodega i haven't seen the tomato for a while probably because i started the tomatoes quests i'm talking about the mini boss tomato I probably probably because i started the quest for it and then just said forget it I don't care. But yeah, this might take a while trying to get all of the flink stuff. Now, the flink stuff is a specific drop uh, from Battle Rods, the Battle Rods mod. It's called Flink's Fur, I believe. So, I don't know. Do flinks spawn often? Not really. They're not an enemy. I'm like, oh man, another flinks. Fuck off. But when I do see them in general, I'm, they're not exactly the most welcomed monster. But we'll see what happens. We will see indeed. People uh, ask me if I'm going to stream this playthrough at all. I probably will. Eventually. Just give me some time. There you go. Let's get the quest. Give me some time. Get a couple of episodes out. And once I feel like I need to start streaming for like building or something. Or anything that needs to be farmed. Then I'll start doing it. Because we still have the yo-yo playthrough. That's a primarily stream-only series. And I want to probably finish that before I start up just streaming the fish character. Is that Topaz right there? Okay, I was wondering why I couldn't mind that. 
But yeah, so far, no flinxes. We could probably do some fishing in here. Now that I think about it, might as well. Might as well. Okay, it really sucks having this carpet. If we get a mount very soon, I'll take that over the carpet. Let's see what we can get. Oh, seaweed? Uh, joke's on you. It's useful. I may not know what it's useful for, but it is. So joke's on you. Come on. Is it because it's underneath that? It, it was because it was underneath that. Couldn't bob under the ice. We're doing some ice fishing though. I just heard like three like zombie growls. Driftwood. You can't even place it. <laughs> uh, seaweed. Let's see here. Like a planter, kelp lamp, and a fish gatherer. That's going to be really useful for later. Well, when can we make it? We can make that like anytime we want if I really put my mind to it. Just like anything in life. This is a lesson from Game Raider. Just like anything in life, if you put your mind to it, you can do it. Just letting you know, unless you're like a five foot dude and you're trying to become an NBA player. I don't know if that's going to work. I'm just being honest, man. I know I just said you can do anything if you like put all your mind to it. Come on, think about it. Five foot NBA player. Like there wasn't very many of those. I don't even think there was a single one. Maybe like five foot two. But uh, maybe you got to try out something else first. Just like an accounting job would work. I don't you know. Maybe just think of other things. I wish these were used for something. Maybe they are used for something. And maybe I'm auto trashing the most legendary item right there. The cassette. It's just called cassette. There's nothing else. It's just cassette. Okay, hold up. Is there any? I think we should just go straight down right here. We do have bombs. Ooh, there's cobweb over here. That means there's got to be an opening. There has to be. Let's peep it. All right, hold up. Let's do this. I'm not going to make it sticky. I don't want to use any gel. We're not exactly, you know, chilling with the amounts of gel we have. Wasn't there a slime? Oh, there it is. Who? Kill it. Kill it. Get that nasty ice slime. Just imagine being a slime and being an ice slime. Do you think slimes are like racist to each other? Or do you think they're like way better than humans because they like they can act civil with each other? They're like, oh, you're different from me? We're all the same underneath. We're all just some gel at the end of the day. Especially when we get slaughtered for an adventurer's amusement. I mean, it's like... It's like uh, the food chain, man. The Terraria character, he's like the top of the food chain pretty much. He kills everything. Pretty much. So like the humans in Terraria, they're on top of the food chain. When they die, they just come back to life. But I guess the bosses are the same because you can keep on respawning them. But let's just pretend, alright? Let's pretend they can't. You kill them once and you don't respawn them, they're dead forever. They don't got no life. Unless you're the Leviathan. The Leviathan keeps on coming back though. That, that thick fish keeps on coming back. What is that button flowing on? What? Yo, what the hell? What is it floating on? That's some hacking shit right there. What the heck? Oh, it was trying to, it was trying to spawn in some skellies. How about not? Nah? No skellies today. But it's been a while. Not really. I was like up there in the last clip and then I'm down here. But I still haven't seen a single flinks. I think they spawn in more open areas, but it's a cave, so like, unless you want me to man open it, manually open an area, man-made open area, it ain't happening. Well, actually, there's kind of an open area down here. Let's see, let's see what we can get done here. From what I know, there's no special tactic to spawn in flinxes, so uh, this armor might be a lot harder than I thought it would be to get. Actually, I thought it was always going to be hard to get. So, like, that's... Oh, my. Oh, my God. He hit me twice. All right. I might have blown myself up. We're breaking into here. What y'all got down here? I'm stuck. Show me what goodies you got, but don't run at me too fast. That's scary. Please do not do that. No, there's not really anything to drink here. There's that. I really need a grappling hook. Uh-oh. Uh, I need you to kill Get rid of him. Oh, okay, these aren't affected by cobwebs. Oh, I actually got him. Watch this, I can go through the wall. Whoa! Okay, that wasn't really going through the wall. I didn't expect him to come up here. Don't worry, we got the carpet, man. We got the carpet, we're good to go. 
break that. Oh god, that okay. Maybe that wasn't the greatest idea. Whew. I almost died. Okay, don't break any more of those. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need you. Oh god. I don't have a grappling hook. All right, we got something interesting here. I was gonna go to the right, go to the ocean, go fishing, get some extra equipment. But look what I spotted on the mini map. Is this guy gonna bother me? Don't bother me. We're making our way slowly down here. Oh, there he is. The tomato man. Oh, fuck. Don't kill me. It's so bad not having... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All right, let's try this like nothing ever happened. It's so bad not having mobility. The, only, the best mobility we have is goddamn carpet and a rope. Oh, my God. Please stop. Uh, stop. <laughs> Oh my god, what the fuck? Alright, we're taking the most careful, careful, careful route possible. Can you kill it? Kill it. Kill it. Go kill it. Can you stop flying over me? He's like, should, should I attack him? He's like, questioning his services towards me. There you go. You got him. Alright, this time, let's kill this tomato bastard. Let's make a floor we can stand on. Get away from me. Let's make a floor we can stand on and slowly go... Oh my god, he goes so high up. Slowly go down with this floor. Because we want to live. You getting him? You got him. Yeah, I'll throw, I'll throw this down there. Hopefully that's helping. Oh my god. <laughs> they, just, they just keep coming. What are you doing? Stop. <laughs> the thing, what sucks about the battle rods, you can't use them on ropes. So I have to like get to like a flat surface and then I can attack. I grabbed onto something. Okay, we're going, going lower and lower. Oh, he's stuck in there, isn't he? I hope he is. If he ain't stuck in there, we about to, we about to get our ass whooped. You got it. You got it under control, man. I'll, I'll try my best to help. I'm trying my best to, like, bounce it off of this. There you go. Look how many zombies are coming down here. Like, chill out. I came here to fight a tomato, not fight the goddamn horde. I don't have G-Realm installed. That was actually one of the mods I was thinking about installing for the series, but we have it for the Yo-Yo series. And the mod I decided to install specifically for this series is a split mod. But I got some inside sources, guys. anti -Aris is going to be updated. anti -Aris? anti -Aris? I don't know what's the actual name. There's not much I can do about that. Somehow he hit me. Somehow he hit me like a pixel. Can you just kill the tomato? Kill the tomato. I'm trying my best to help. I'm sending. Oh, I got the worm. I got the worm. Hey, don't take that with you. Get down there. Get down there. Help out. Help out a little. Oh my god, it's the ropes, guys. It's the ropes. Throw some stingers in there. That's it. I'm tired of this. There we go. We got the head. I'm throwing some stingers in here. Jeez, that took so long. Do I even want to turn this in? Do you know how far he is? He's all the way over there. Dude, can these worms get, actually no? Can it keep coming? They drop the cactus bait, which is pretty useful. All right, what is? Oh, it's an updated sprite. See, I thought it was a new item. There we go, calamity. Updating sprites again. Oh, look, my fishing pal is here. Do you think I can accomplish this quest before daytime? Oh, it's still the same day apparently. Weird. I don't know how it's the same day, but uh. Let's do some fishing. Hopefully this guy doesn't get up here. Oh, it's good that I got my guardian angel over here. Psych! So over there fighting something to the left. You got it under control, man. Um, what the fuck? Fish up something. Oh, come on. And Bob, too. All right, kill the troll. All right, you know it. He's just going to run. Just leave him alive. See, look, he wants to kill him. I, I said leave him alive. He wants to kill him. That's so rude. Come on. Let's get some more than tunas. Ooh. He didn't really drop anything interesting. I just said, ooh, you know, I, if you guys weren't paying attention to the video, I said, ooh, and that might have made you pay attention. Notice how my bobber bobbed like five times when I reeled it in. I got nothing. It's probably because my, like, fishing power is low, but come on, man. How are you going to bob that shit like five times and give me nothing? You're obviously interested. You obviously want my attention, but you ain't giving me nothing. That's so rude. It's like, it's like knocking on somebody's door and you're waiting for them to answer. Now on the third knock, they're about to come. They're coming to answer the door. You just leave. They open the door. They're like, what the fuck? Who the hell be knocking on my door? They thought you, they're probably thinking you were joking around with them. Yeah, you guys get what I'm saying. I, I don't need to explain. You guys obviously understand. Obviously. I don't need to explain anything. 
Now, I don't think this fishing knife is working correctly. Or at least I never have seen it work correctly. I don't know. I, I've used it a bunch of times. And, or not used it a bunch of times. That first episode, we had a bunch of chances for it to, like, activate. And it never did. At least I don't remember it activating. Ooh, we got a bubble shield. I mean, it's not bad. I don't want to replace an, an accessory slot for it, though. It's, that's too much to give up. A whole accessory slot for that. I don't know why there's platforms in here. Oh, I guess this was for the, the fishermen when I woke them up. But let's do this. Just so I got more room to fish on. A little bit more room. I can come out here a little bit. We need way better, like, everything. 30%? That's really good already, though, for early game. That's probably the best we're going to get. Hey, let's talk about the idea of the accessory thing uh, what was i talking about uh, more accessory slots so like i said there's one boss from the uh battle rods mod and that is let me show you right here if i can show you hopefully we don't spoil any other cool looking bosses whoa don't look too hard at all this stuff all right what is that huh <laughs> I'm spoiling stuff. All right, hold up. I'm looking for him. What is, is that cabinet? Oh, there it is. Cooler. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. <laughs> There's the boss right there. That's when the boss. He doesn't actually look like that. He looks a lot cooler. Ha! <laughs> Good one, gamers. He looks a lot cooler when you fight him. I've seen his pictures on the wiki. He looks cool. All right. Not just also because he's a cooler. He, he's just cool. All right, man. Chill out. There's, there's nothing else to it. You're looking too deep into it. He's just a shark. I want to kill you. Hey, I want to kill you. I want to see what you drop. I'm using all my weaponry on the shark. Oh, I threw an extra one. No, I can't get it. It's too far. It's too far. I can't go down there. It's spooky down there. So, we kill this shark. We can make all these weapons. This is allowed. You guys will slowly get the rule. If it's fishing related, more than likely we'll make it. More than likely. Well, I was, I was talking about something before, and I just stopped. What the fuck was it? Oh, the cooler. If we beat, we're gonna beat the cooler. We're gonna add an extra ex accessory slot. I'm not gonna do it for every single water theme boss because that's way too many. There's at least four or five. We already get like two throughout the playthrough. One, two, yeah, I think it's two. We get one after Moon Lord, one after Wall of Flesh. So there you go. <laughs> and then we'll get the one after we fight the cooler. As our little thing. Some people are like, fuck it, just use extra accessory slots or whatever that mod is called. Like, what, what the hell are you talking about, man? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna have like ten, what, five? This is five, right? I'm not gonna have ten accessory slots. There's no point in using the extra accessory slot. I don't even remember the name of the mod. He's gonna walk into my thing. I'm trying to fish! I don't want you. You're a shark. Are sharks fishes? They're sharks. I don't know. They sound, I think they're in the fish category. Kill it quicker, dude. We really need some stronger weapons. We're hitting hard, though. See how hard we're hitting? Jeez. I think we hit a bunch of... I mean, we only have a 13% critical strike chance. So, who knows? But, I think what I'm gonna do is... I'm gonna cut right here, and every... I wasn't paying attention. And every clip from this point on will just be, like, sped up. Every fishing clip from this point on will be sped up. At least in this episode. So, here, cut it.
all right we're gonna open up some crates here and hopefully we get some good believe it or not it is daytime because a message popped up a second ago we're not gonna open up the odd one until these enemies are cleared out boom bada bing what the fuck it really gave me three gold bars that's trash Ooh, falcon blade okay 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 everything else was not the greatest but i'll take i'll take the falcon blade that's pretty nice added another chest this is like our fishing chest primarily probably should put most fish related items in there not all of them just most of them will stuff in there tungsten lead bar okay we could probably upgrade our fishing pole again now we did get a reaver shark and we did get a swordfish so i'm pretty hyped we got some goodies from that fishing adventure we got some real goodies uh where's the cobweb boom let's see the damage does 37 i'm assuming the platinum does more because it seems like that's how it always goes increased fishing skill that might be useful that might be a very very useful the platinum one does the same thing okay uh let's see here boom platinum battle rod that's that's what we're gonna make just three more damage we're going we're going up since it's not i don't know i don't think we're gonna be able to get the armor today or yeah the flinks armor we might have to do that during another episode because it is a little bit harder to get than i thought it was gonna be so we might just hold out on that for now we do have a hunter potion i'll give it another try definitely will but uh we'll see what we can get done dude look how many potions we have now jeez all right falcon blade i gotta replace something i think these urchin stingers gotta go something has to go we'll see we'll, we'll figure out something Okay, let me just make it easier for me to get out once I do this. How do you do it? You just place it? Probably should break that. I think you just... Oh, no, you open it. Okay, never mind. Ah! Don't kill me. All right. Where the hell is my fish guy? Come over here. I'll handle these guys. You can handle him, all right? All right, now I'll handle him, too. Let me try my best to use these because these do a decent amount of damage these not so much the fly fishes but i will try my best to use them too so i don't know how that doesn't fit can i hit him if i if i hover perfectly can i hit him ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh shit he's out hey hey where the hell dude these things suck these are just like disposable dude i gotta auto trash these in the future what the heck is this i'm i'm tickling the dude or whatever it is i'm tickling the crate with no gender from what i know of oh <gasps> yo <laughs> this is exactly what we need i don't do you guys count this it seems pretty legit it's like how calamity did like it's little shrines that you can get like late 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 game stuff i don't know why i said late like 30 times what do you guys think about that should i, should I keep with the items i mean it's pretty useful i do really need that i did really need a grappling hook so I'm gonna I'm gonna use it at least for the duration of the rest of this episode. But let's go back to the left. We're gonna try again to get some flink stuff. I probably will just cut it and then just see what I can find off camera. If I don't find anything, we'll just end the episode off. Uh, yeah, <laughs> plain and simple. That's that's how we're gonna do it. So uh, give me a second. I'm gonna see if we get lucky. I hope they drop a lot when they die because I have no idea. Damn, he just machine gun him. I have no idea how much they drop, and I have no no idea what the armor is even called. Flinks? How do you even spell flinks? So there's a flinks hat. There you go. We're getting somewhere with flink stuff. So it's pretty cheap. It didn't even cost that much. Fungal spores. What the hell is that? Okay, so we're down here. I did find some flink stuff. Look at that. Flinks for just a single piece. This is not going to be an easy thing to acquire. So I think we'll acquire in the next episode. Go ahead, go to the clip where I get the tomato head. It's weird, I recorded the clips backwards. All right, turn the episode off. I'm gonna give this guy bodega. I'm gonna give him the tomato head. And he gives us another tomato head. A tomato head for a tomato head. What a good trade. Look at it, getting on the carpet. Oh my God. Oh my. 